The Freestyle OA is easy to put on, but before you start, first set the hinge setting to zero. Then you want to sit with your knee bent at a 30 degree angle in a gas pedal position. With the brace fully open, place it on your leg. The brace should align with the outside of the leg like this. Now we'll go through the strapping sequence. As you can see, the straps are numbered, making it easy to follow the correct order. Hold the brace with one hand. Use the other hand to pull tab number one across the thigh above the knee and fasten it securely. As you go through the application process, make sure each strap is tightened to fit the knee snugly but comfortably. Pull strap two across the shin below the knee and fasten it securely. Pull tab three across the lower shin. Now, tab number four, pull it across the upper thigh. Finally, pass strap number five through the ring on the outside of the thigh. To make sure the brace doesn't move, continue to hold the brace with one hand while you pull the strap snugly and attach it back on itself. Do the same for strap number six. Your Freestyle OA brace has a thumb wheel dial, which makes it easy to adjust the amount of force applied to your knee and provide pain relief. Turn the dial clockwise to increase pressure to the outside of the knee and counterclockwise to reduce pressure. Make sure you start with a low setting to allow your knee to adjust to wearing the brace. Gradually increase pressure using the thumb wheel dial over time as needed to achieve pain relief. Now, you're ready to go. After walking around for a few minutes, your body fluid levels will change. If the brace feels loose, you can adjust it by tightening the straps for a snug fit. If you experience any increased pain, swelling, skin irritation, or any adverse reactions when using a Freestyle OA brace, stop using the brace and contact your doctor immediately. You'll need to clean your Freestyle OA brace periodically, depending on your activity level and how much you perspire. Hand wash your brace in cold water with a mild detergent. Rinse, lay flat, and air dry. Do not machine wash or tumble dry. Occasionally, you may want to apply a dry lubricant like Teflon spray to the hinge after washing. Don't use WD-40 or other solvent-based products or oil or grease since they can attract dirt to the hinge. If you need a reminder of how to put on the brace, just scan the QR code on the label of your brace with your QR code enabled smartphone to view this video again. Or you can go to Bragg.com to view this video online. You can also refer to the instructions for use or IFU pamphlet that came with your brace or view the pamphlet on the Bragg website. Rather talk to a person Call Bregg Customer Care at 1-800-897-BREGG, that's B-R-E-G, or 2734. If you have questions about knee bracing, ask your doctor. The Freestyle OA knee brace is designed to be easy to use, but there are a few tips that might help with fit and comfort. The brace features finger pockets to make it easy to apply. Use these when tightening tabs one through four. In order to prevent the brace from rotating when you apply the brace, hold the plastic ring with one hand while tightening the strap with the other hand. If you still have fitting problems, contact the healthcare professional who provided you with the brace and request further adjustments. If you have general questions about your Freestyle OA brace, call Bragg Customer Care at 1-800-897-BREG. That's B-R-E-G or 2734. You'll find more information about the Freestyle OA knee brace at www.breg.com.